Self-discipline is one of the most critical skills that you need to develop to achieve anything at work or in life. Unfortunately, it is also one area where most people struggle. Whether you are a student preparing for year end exams or a CEO driving the execution of your strategy, we all find it challenging at times to stay on track. The truth is that self-discipline sets high performers apart from the average. Self-discipline is what makes you go for a run on days when you don't feel like it. It is what makes you choose what you want most over what you want now. It is what keeps you focused on your objectives when your motivation fades away. Without this self-reliance and resilience to be able to do things on a continuous basis, you can't bring your goals to reality. That's why today and over the next two episodes, I will share with you three secrets that will help you improve your self-discipline and get things done. The first secret that will help you develop the self-discipline that you need to achieve your most important goal is to emotionally engage with your life purpose and your most important goal every morning. Why am I linking emotions and self-discipline? Because self-discipline is about decisions. It's about consistently making the choices that are aligned with your goals. We know that our emotions play a crucial role in the decisions we make. Antonio Damasio is a neuroscientist who carried out extensive research on the importance of emotions in decision-making. One of his patients, Elliot, was a successful businessman who suffered the brain damage in the part of the brain where emotions are generated while having surgery to remove a tumor. After the surgery, Elliot still had high cognitive abilities and a high IQ. However, he was no longer able to make simple decisions like choosing a restaurant for the evening. Any project he did were either left incomplete or had to be corrected. Eventually, Elliot lost his job and his marriage collapsed. Damasio explained that the reason why patients like Elliot can't choose is that they haven't got that sort of lifts that comes from emotion. It is emotion that allows us to mark things as good, bad, or indifferent, literally in the flesh, and make us decide to go in one direction or another. Self-discipline is about consistently making the choices that are aligned with your goals. You therefore have to continuously reactivate the emotional state that makes you choose your most important goals over everything else. Most people don't do that. And every passing hour, they make random choices and waste their precious time living other people's lives. So what can you do? Every morning, before you start anything else, remind yourself of your life purpose and your most important goals. If you are not already doing that, I strongly invite you to start doing it tomorrow morning. Visualize yourself doing the task that will make you progress towards that goal. That way, when the time comes, you will complete this important report for your manager because that's the kind of professional you want to be. You will deliver massive value to your customers because that's the kind of entrepreneur you want to be. You will give full attention to your children because that's the kind of parents you want to be. This is your leadership tip for this week. Emotionally engage with your life purpose and your most important goal every morning. That's the first secret for greater self-discipline. With that, I wish you a very good week. I will see you again next Monday when I will reveal the second secret of greater self-discipline. Make sure to subscribe below now and be first to receive it. Until then, take responsibility for everything that happens to you and be committed to serving others. That's how you become and remain the leader that you trust and respect. 